On June 5th, Boeing's Starliner capsule launched on an Atlas V rocket. It was headed for the International Space Station. That launch came after several delays in the spring and years of delays in development and testing. The Starliner did dock safely with the International Space Station with veteran astronauts Butch Wilmore and Sonny Wilson on board. The original plan was for Wilmore and Wilson to spend a week on the ISS before riding the Starliner back to Earth. Obviously, it's been two months and that still hasn't happened. In fact, it could be next year before they feel gravity or a breeze again. Here's Tom Costello with more. We are having a great time here on ISS. Floating some 250 miles above the Earth, astronauts Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams thought their trip to the space station and back would last about 10 days. That was two months ago. Now, NASA mission managers say they could stay there for another six months, leaving their Starliner spaceship and returning home in an Elon Musk SpaceX Dragon capsule on a future Crew-9 mission. And then we could return four crew members uh, in the February 2025 timeframe, and Butch and Sonny would remain on station and return home with them on Crew-9. And liftoff of Starliner at Atlas V. Boeing's troubled Starliner launched on a test flight in early June, but it's remained docked at the space station. NASA and Boeing engineers remain divided over whether it's safe to bring Wilmore and Williams back on Starliner. Their concern, helium leaks and engine thruster problems could pose serious risks. Starliner needs those thrusters to safely return home. Let's go forward into Starliner. Where Last month, Williams and Wilmore insisted their ship is safe. Are you confident in the performance of the ship for future missions as well? well that's a fair question. Uh, I can tell you that, you know, that mantra you've heard, failure is not an option. That's why we are staying here now. NASA is now weighing whether to bring Starliner home autonomously without a crew. It's now delayed the SpaceX Crew-9 liftoff to late September, returning next year, and may launch with only two astronauts rather than four. Wilmore and Williams would remain on station well past Thanksgiving, Christmas, and New Year's, then return with Crew-9 in February. In a statement, Boeing says we still believe in Starliner's capability and its flight rationale. If NASA decides to change the mission, we will take the actions necessary to configure Starliner for an uncrewed return. That's Tom Costello reporting. And while they're in space, Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams are helping out with research and upkeep that makes up day-to-day -day life on the space station.